Good afternoon guys, uh, my name is Harry as I'm sure you've seen by the title of the video I'm going to be speaking about a very popular Christian rapper who goes by the name of Lecrae so for those of you who don't know him, Lecrae is an African American gospel rapper he's very popular, he has won Grammys before uh, he has performed in Africa and Sudan, he has performed in Paris which is in France he has performed in Denmark, I mean he's all over the place he has even been on popular radio stations like Power 106 FM uh, he has met up with popular stars like The Game uh, basketball players and quite a number of uh, celebrities today, rappers, singers alike raps about a positive lifestyle they say he raps about monogamy and uh, positivity and so forth since he is a Christian rapper but I was just going through uh, some of his Instagram pics and just reading up about him there are a couple of things that don't really add up together about this guy I mean some of the pictures or the photographs he has taken are quite questionable and uh, so for those of you who don't believe in the Illuminati, the One World Order, who don't believe that the music industry and the whole entertainment industry is run by Satanists who perform gay rituals and so forth, well, then this video is not for you. Because you're just going to think I'm crazy and call me some crazy conspiracy theorist. Well, just to let you know, I'm not one of those people who just lose their minds over seeing Jay-Z make that triangle symbol and think oh he's part of the Illuminati and so forth this and that it takes dedication and research as well so it's just it's a little bit more than hand signs and symbols you know you need to look into this stuff and see what they actually mean and where they originated from for example the Baphomet sign which most of you think is the I love you sign well, I happened to do uh, some research and I found that it's actually the symbol for uh, Baphomet, which is the demon that resides in the music industry, or a symbol for Satan himself. And where did I get this information? From the guy who came up with the Satanic Bible himself, Antoine LaVey. You could look it up for yourselves and you see that it does not mean I love you. Well, let's I digress. Back to Mr. Lecrae. Yeah, just a couple of photographs that uh, really didn't sit well with me for a Christian rapper. First of all, should a Christian rapper be mingling with all of these circular rappers and musicians and artists and getting their awards? Which means he's doing something right for them to give him these awards. There's a photograph where he's been awarded a Grammy and right behind him you could see the all-seeing eye and the all-seeing eye as we know of course represents satan himself as well the all-seeing eye we see it on the dollar bill we see it on top of uh, pyramids and various pictures and so forth most secular satan uh, most secular satanic celebrities as well uh, love to portray themselves with the all-seeing eye whether it be the album covers or movie covers they always have some kind of photograph where only one eye shows well mr lecrae also has that as well and I was thinking once again for a Christian rapper he should know better than doing these kinds of things because of course people are going to ask questions of course it's going to cause controversy so it's either he doesn't care about what people think and he's just doing his own thing or he knows exactly what he's doing and he's down with the buff mates because that's how he gets his popularity and his checks now we're not saying everyone who's successful is part of the Illuminati or an Illuminati puppet. First of all, let me clear one thing. Jay-Z, Beyonce, uh, Antoine LaVey, uh, you know, and all of these other satanic people are not the Illuminati. They're just Illuminati puppets. So they're being used by the Illuminati, which is another fraction, which is another part of the Free Freemasons. Now Freemasons, this is a, uh, it's an elite group of people rich people who are not even famous people like the Rothschild um, the Rockefeller families and a couple of presidents and so forth these people this elite group of people make up the Freemasons and the uh, goal is to run the world one day with a new world order so they control business they control the judicial system and so many other things 
well don't take my word for it or don't take anyone else's word for it you do your own research and you look up into this so Lecrae I was just questioning a couple of the photographs that he has taken and the things that he has done he's got this uh, sweater or jersey that he always wears with a pyramid looking symbol and he has uh, another jacket that he usually wears as well with another symbol that looks like a pyramid well in today's society you should know that those things represent um, Satanism they are associated with the Illuminati hence all of these secular artists are caught wearing this stuff so why would you as a Christian rapper go out and wear these things uh, his friends throwing up the Baphomet sign or symbol hand symbol he throws it as well so this guy is quite questionable I would suggest that uh, my Christian brothers and sisters out there just examine his music even the Bible says we should examine one another examine his music examine him you can judge him by his fruits and then you'll be able to make an informed decision for yourself as for me I think he's a little bit suspect but let me know what you guys think my name is Harry and I'm out